The museum was uh, started in, in 2011 and it was a, a project to turn this wonderful old building into uh, a living museum that would have a blacksmith working, uh, involve the local community in the project. Um, we were all a grouping of volunteers that came together to actually deliver it. So uh, we've all come from different backgrounds, brought different skills to be able to make uh, what we have today. Uh, and part of that process was really Museum Development East Midlands who have supported us along the path. They've helped us in a number of ways. One which is uh, retail, space, anal analysis and how to get our name out. Uh, another one is about accreditation and we became an accredited museum. And the, the final one is, is about bringing young people into the museum working with schools and how to maximise my our offering to those uh, children. Thank you Museum Development East Midlands, uh, you've been an inspiration to us. Uh, we have achieved incredible amount in the period of time and, and so a lot of it's down to you, big thank you. Uh, we're developing uh, and we want to get uh, involved more with young people, getting heritage crafts out into the community uh, we're also interested in our new ventures of 3D printing. 3D printing is, is a fantastic uh, process that we've, we've now, in, and that's now in our innovations area. We want to take that out into schools so the schools have an opportunity to get involved with uh, 3D printing and design and manufacture. Uh, which I think is so important. Um, we also want to, to get the business proposition uh, worked at so that we can look at how to develop uh, a museum with an innovation area within it. What is it that the community wants? Uh, also, what can we uh, make as a business to actually develop in the future?